Hello YouTube, this is Morgan Airspeed Prime here with my next Avatar news update video. This is just a quick one to cover some news before um, tomorrow when we are expecting, I guess, some sort of an update from EW about Netflix Avatar, obviously in their last kind of big uh, article talking about the um, change that they're doing with the comet. They did at the end mention that there is a special reveal coming on Monday. We don't know exactly what that is, but... It surely, I guess, has to be more screenshots, character images. Maybe they'll have some exclusive footage to show off. But um, either way, there's something happening on Monday. But uh, just before that, um, Avatar, the official Twitter account for Netflix Avatar, has posted a little clip compilation of Aang. So I'm guessing the other characters are going to get one as well. Uh, it's just this, as you can see here, 14 second thing with about four or five little clips, uh, a couple of which we've seen, a couple we haven't seen, and I'll talk about that in just a second, but I'm guessing they're going to do these for Katara, Zuko, Sokka, most of the main cast. It'll be interesting to see how uh, how deep they go into the character roster with these um, kind of character kind of videos. Um, and also what the kind of schedule of release for them is going to be. Like, is there another one of these coming tomorrow? Might that be what EW is doing? Do they get to reveal like the Zuko clip compilation or something like that? Um, or are these just going to be spread out over the next couple of weeks? It, it will be interesting now that we're in the kind of countdown to release now just how much extra stuff there is actually going to be. Uh, one of the main things I definitely want to see is probably... Um, I, like a minute of footage like a full ish scene I guess I'd like to see just a contained scene that's probably one of the things that I really want to see at this point but anyway let's get into the trailer so I'm just going to highlight the new scenes uh, I don't think there's any real point in highlighting um stuff that we've already seen before like Ang flying to Crescent Island is in here the shot of Ang kind of with the staff kind of uh, leaning forward so we start off with this interesting shot here and it is again we have some dialogue narration from Gyatso, uh, there's actually a scene with Gyatso, um, but it is Aang, it, what seems to be demonstrating his airbending to Katara. I'm guessing this is part of the whole, hey, can you teach me to be a bender? Aang being like, hey, I'm an airbender, because <laughs> um, he's not revealing he's the, he's the avatar just yet, but here's what I can tell you about um, just bending in general as a master air uh, airbender. Master Bender, here's how I can kind of give you some advice about channeling your chi as someone who maybe has no formal training. So yeah, he just uses air bending to blast this pile of uh, snow off of this uh, as Katara watches on. Um, Gyatso, as this is happening, talks to Aang about, you know, you are special. Aang mentions, you know, uh, I never asked to be special. Gyatso says, uh, you're the most talented airbender I've ever seen. Um, and we do get a look at Gyatso. You are the avatar. That's why Aang is special. So we get our first proper look at Gyatso here. Um, looks good. I'm very eagerly awaiting to see the scenes that they've kind of added in highlighting Gyatso during like the Sozin's Comet sequence but also you know this is clearly from Ang flashback scenes and how exactly they kind of line all that stuff up because obviously Ang's flashbacks in the original are like the main place we get Gyatso from but we're actually I'm guessing going to get to see Gyatso before we meet Ang in this kind of uh, version of the show because they're starting with the kind of air nomad genocide scene so that'll be an interesting one and um, to see exactly how it goes but it looks good this has the kind of um you know mentor kind of relationship but also the kind of father figure style relationship as well and ang dealing with you know just wanting a normal life but he is the avatar that destiny is you know was chosen for him reluctant avatar um, it's it's an interesting one, um, but I like this. Uh, this is, I think, a good way to add in kind of new scenes with characters. And like I said, I'm I'm I'm, I'm eager to see some of this stuff. Of like, I want to see Iro and Zuko talking a little bit in one of these scenes. I'm guessing that's one way to do it if you're doing these kind of thematic ones where um, Zuko and Iro can talk, of course. Um, 
uh, might might we get our first look potentially at like Hakoda um, in like either the Katara or Sokka kind of clips if we get them. But either way, it's just a nice quick little thing. I like that they're doing regular little updates on the social media. And it's not just a case of the trailer has come out. Now wait a bunch of weeks and we'll kind of ramp things up until the, uh, the release in a few weeks time. Um, so that's that. And then we do have um one extra piece of information this is uh it's not netflix avatar news but i thought it was just an interesting one here um in terms of it's a bit of a kind of tricky one in terms of how this was found basically we have the announcement of a or at least somewhat of a listing for a new quora book now where this comes from is we of course know about avatar the last airbender heart of a hero it's a avatar picture book that's coming out shortly after the release of Netflix Avatar, just a few days afterwards, the 27th of February. This book, which is 40 pages with some really nice new art. Uh, we've seen a decent look at this. It's obviously a much more expanded style picture book compared to like the I Am Ang or I Am Zuko books. Um, but it looks like it's going to be pretty nice with a new art by Debbie Oak. And Kat Zhang is going to be the uh, author, the writer of this. So we've known about this for some time. But if you look on the listing, there's a few extra things going on here. One of which is if you click the related button on Edelweiss, it opens up this book here. And if you search Cora, if you search a bunch of other stuff, this book does not come up. But you can see listed down here, also by Kat Zhang, is a hardcover picture book called Legend of Cora. And when you open that one up, you get this. From Little Brown Books for Young Readers is just a general listing here for a book called Legend of Korra Picture Book. Kat Zhang. The date, though, is kind of crazy. The 4th of May, 2027. And we're only finding out about this now. Like in the last couple of weeks, months, I don't even know when. Uh, because it's so kind of hidden. Who knows how long this has been up for. I did a search around the place and I can't find any listing of this anywhere. It is a weird one because you'd think, given that they're doing this, and it's probably going to be pretty successful, um, that surely they'd follow it up with a Korra book relatively soon after that. So the idea that they actually have a book planned and announced for 2027 already is very weird. I don't know, uh, is this just a placeholder date and this will be brought forward depending on how exactly Heart of a Hero does? I don't really know because otherwise there's no information on this like at all. Um, it just mentions like a, you know, a bunch of stuff about Avatar that's pretty similar to the stuff that we've seen before. Um, nothing really else apart from the fact that it seems like the same author Kat Zhang is attached to this and who knows maybe the artist will also continue over but um, given that we most of the time never really hear about Korra merchandise this is somewhat interesting but definitely somewhat undercut by the whole idea of like 2027 like we we still f are in this mode where we feel like you know Avatar Studios like October 2025 is a really long time away even the month that we have to wait for Netflix Avatar is a long time away a Korra product announced for like two years post the start of Avatar Studios when by the time this comes out, we should maybe have a couple of Avatar Studios projects. We might be looking at like the second, third season of Netflix Avatar by the time this comes out. It's just a, a crazy thing to think about of just a relatively low level sort of book for Avatar, just like a picture book that not too many people are going to like overly focus on. Yet this is like one of the furthest off into the future things for Avatar we sort of know about. It's just, um, it's funny how a lot of this stuff ends up working out in that way. But um, yeah, that's uh, basically everything here in the video. So yeah, let me know what your thoughts are on this. Uh, Little Brown Books is going to be getting a Korra picture book. It's 40 pages as well. It's got the same dimensions. So it basically is a Korra Heart of a Hero style book. What are your thoughts on that? I know I think most Korra fans are probably going to be excited because we don't really get a lot. Uh, but then... Uh, any thoughts on what you think the EW reveal tomorrow, Monday, is going to be? And uh, last but not least, of course, this uh, promo video here about Aang, where we get a first proper look at Gyatso, plus some other shots. Uh, what are your thoughts on this? And uh, what do you think the rollout's going to be in terms of 
seeing more of this stuff when will we get other character videos and how how much footage content are we going to see prior to um release basically because like this ew thing like it could be something kind of interesting if they give us like more of an extended clip or something but anyway that's just some speculation but uh yeah in the comments let me know what your thoughts are on all this news but that's been the video thanks for watching and bye